Gemini. <laughs> Sorry, guys. This sign just makes me emotional. <laughs> Holy Spirit. So in time, slow and steady, the night comes in, but they make sure they have crossed all their T's and dot all their I's, um, and they're going to close out things properly, but then they're going to come, and an emperor drives the chariot. So they may be appearing as a knight now, but like I always said, they're going towards passion because there's been a lot of growth. There's movement, both of these. This is a horse, too, and it's going to pick up. They might be going a night horse speed now, but it's going to pick up. It's going to pick up into an emperor driving the chariot. And the happiest card in the deck, the sun. Towards the happiest card in the deck, the sun. Let's dig deeper. SS. There's deception because they're sneaking away because they can't let something go. They're sneaking around to give this younger girl some flowers. But there's deception. But what they need to do is fully jump off the love cliff and stop dipping their toes in two waters at once. It's, it should be obvious by now. I mean, it may, it's obvious by now. And they're ready to cut ties with the devil. Yet, why is she still popping up? There needs to be quick, fast, incoming communication about a reconciliation. To go towards a sexy queen with the tightest poos poos. Period. For this past soulmate connection. It all makes so much sense now. If I'm having this type of clarity as a divine feminine, the divine masculines that are waking up should be having the same type of downloads, prophetic divine ma downloads being vesseled through them at this moment. There, there's there been a shift in the energy this evening. I felt it, and things are so clear to me. Twin flames are people that you grow are supposed to grow along spiritual lines with that are going to bring you, prepare you for your past life soulmate that you'll be passed along to. Twin flames are a little bit toxic. You're a little bit addicted to them. You are, like, not good for each other. Like, you don't do your best work when you're with them. They kind of, like, help you to slack off a bit. They don't, you're always convincing yourself that it is them. You have to literally, literally convince yourself to be into them. Like, and convince yourself out of being interested in your past life soulmate. From my experience, I liter literally have to lie to myself in order to stay in it. Um, and it's because I didn't have enough self-worth to think I could get my dream come true, which is my past life soulmate. It also is, it's the easier catch. It's someone that's like, not on my level, spiritually, not equally yoked. That's a nicer way to put it. And like, and then the other one is, and it's more of like a stretch and a reach. And it's like, that like giving up because like not knowing my self-worth now I know my self-worth and I'm going for the gold I'm going for exactly what I want saying it loud and proud sticking to it no take backsies and telling my twin flame like I don't want you I want my past life soulmate like God is speaking through me vesseling me I closed out that chapter no more player vibes they need to bring confrontation you can't be the only one. It's time for these devil games and dancing with the devil to be over. Or this is just going to be pissed off all the time with this situation. 
Yeah, it's like probably a good idea to rush in. Quit juggling if you don't want this to be over. What else, Holy Spirit? Yeah, bring in this offer. Bring in this new beginning. What else, SS? Yes. What else, SS? We love you. No, this divine masculine loves you. He's in love with you. This past life soulmate is in love with you. He's in love with you. <sighs> Any advice for these divine masculine Holy Spirit? Stop feeling like a failure. Pick up your bootstraps. Get out of this fucking cruelty. And stop causing it for your empress. And get out of this fucking oppression. Now. And go towards love. <sighs> Dear Lord, I pray that these divine masculines come in with communication. Is it really that hard to their empresses? In Jesus' divine mighty name. Amen, amen, amen. We love you, Lord. Love you, Geminis. <laughs>